welcome to my town, Bucharest, a city of mixture where you can find bits of everything, a city where you can see the most beautiful houses with personality but also drop dead young ugly buildings where rich people meet poor people, everything put together in one place which is my home. We are here in the Revolution Square and this is the only building that uh, still has bullet marks from 1999. We are still in the Revolution Square. Uh, this is one of the most important buildings uh, around here. It housed uh, the Central Committee of the Communist Party before the revolution. Uh, then uh, for uh, uh, 14 or 15 years it housed uh, the Senate, the superior uh, chamber uh, of the of the Romanian Parliament. The University of Bucharest dates from the 19th century. Each year it prepares 30,000 students in various fields such as political science, communication, physics, philosophy, letters, law, medicine, mathematics and many others. Among a um, few of the, its graduates, well we now are Nuncel Iade, the historian of religions, um, Eugenio Nesco, the creator of Absurd Theatre, and uh, Nicolae Titulescu, the statesman. Hello. What is this? Uh, that is the oldest bank from Romania. It's called Czech. Uh, right next to it, you can see a newer bank. You can see a big contrast. This is the biggest of contrast. You can see that everywhere. Here behind me is where the cultural Bucharest starts. This is the Athenaeum, where you can see a lot of beautiful concerts. As you see, in Bucharest we have not only traditional art, but also a lot of street art. Uh, this wall was painted a few months ago uh, during a very nice event uh, when um, all the street was closed for uh, cars and was opened for people. So this masterpiece uh, is made by the most renowned and old uh, graffiti boys in Bucharest. You can also see the, their names in all the streets in the center of the place. We have finally arrived at Europe's door. When will they open? The big thing you see there is the house of the people. Uh, Ceausescu had the ambition to build not only the biggest building in Europe, but also to have the longest boulevard. This Uniri boulevard that we're standing is longer than Champs-Élysées. And the House of the People is not only the biggest building in Europe, but also the second largest concerning the built area after the Pentagon. Um, it was once the symbol of Ceausescu's dictatorship. Now it hosts both the Senate and the Deputy Chamber. We are now next to the National Bank of Romania. Last year we have registered an um, economical growth of around 5%. This is one of the central parks in Bucharest. Here you can come and enjoy the nature and relax when you have some spare time. Of all the places in Bucharest, I mostly like parks. Because here we can come and relax and forget about troubles in daily life. 
and we usually come here to think about our projects and uh, our, our ideas and uh, I think it's nice. In most cases, the results of different public policies are seen here, within the Romanian population. The image of our politicians is created and reflected in daily life. This has been a puzzle of Romania. Do you want to know more? Come and visit us! <laughs>